Another way we can use variables is known as constants. A constant is a name for a variable stored in memory that cannot be changed while the program is running after it has been initialized. So constants like variables are used in programs so that values can be represented with meaningful names. They're very similar to variables except that you provide a value for the constant when you de define it and its value can never change. So in the beginning we would uh, if we want to declare a constant, we're putting the keyword final, and then the type, and then the identifier, and we must set it equal to a value, since we're setting it to a value that can never be changed. And as the same identifier rules as for variables, while the conventions will be different. So we're, here we're going to use all uppercase letters, and instead of camel case, since we're using all uppercase letters, we're going to separate the words by an underscore. So as an example, this underscore is underscore a underscore constant underscore identifier. So all caps with underscores in between the words. This program shows the use of a constant. So we have the program called circle area, which calculates and displays the area of a circle. Uh, pi never changes, so we'll make that into a constant. So we use the word final. Uh, it's a decimal value, so we're going to use the type double. The identifier is pi, all caps, and then we set it equal to here is 3.14. Then we can use values um, to change for the radius and then calculate for the area. So here uh, we can uh, set either a double or an integer. Um, here we set double as the uh, type for the identifier radius. And that allows me to use any type of decimal afterwards as well. So maybe 5.56, um, something that has a decimal. And then since I'm using two double types in my calculation, I want the area also to be double. So then uh, declaring the area as double as well allows me to then set an expression as pi times the radius. And it's the radius squared, so I multiply by the radius again which will then give me the area of a circle, and then I print out uh, the value of the area that's calculated. So there you have our output window that shows us the area of the circle that has a radius of 5.56, using a constant uh, for pi. Now keep in mind that a constant can be assigned a value only once. Trying to change the value of a constant after the initial assignment generates an error. Constant declarations should also be grouped together at the beginning of a method or a block of code before any variable declaration. So you see it there, I did final double pi above my other variables.